Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. U.S. President William Howard Taft visited Natchez on October 29, 1909. His visit was part of an ambitious 13,000-mile, 56-day journey that would take the president through 33 states and territories with a steamboat ride down the Mississippi River from St. Louis to New Orleans. The president wanted the American people to see him and hear his voice, and he felt that the journey would assist him in the discharge of his duties. During his stop in Natchez, he explained the usefulness of his river voyage to a large group gathered on the bluff. He said, this trip has a deeper purpose, and that is to draw to the attention of the country the need for some action in developing the utility of the great waterway that flows at the base of these bluffs. The problem is not solved, but I believe that it is in the process of solution. I believed it because we of the American nation admit no obstacles that we cannot overcome. Taft's visit in Natchez was scheduled to be relatively brief, yet according to the New York Times, the president and his flotilla were three hours late. Mayor Benbrook and the reception committee greeted the president aboard his boat. A court of honor met the president atop the bluff, who had delivered a speech before sent off for Baton Rouge. My name is Stacey Doan, and I'm a junior at Cathedral High School, and this is your Natchez History